She's got spoiled rich girl tendencies. She's even used to maids. Without my parents' blessing, I can't get married. I do feel pressure to make things work because there's only 90 days. Ah! That's not cheating! Hey there, everyone. Welcome back to Reality TV Gossip with TVS's The Juiciest Channel on YouTube, where we spill all the piping hot tea on your favorite reality shows. I'm your host, Emma, and today we're diving headfirst into the drama, tears, and yes, the love that's brewing in 90 Day Fiancé Season 10. But before we dive into the gossip, make sure you hit that subscribe button, smash that like button, and share this video not once, but at least two times. Trust me, you don't want to miss out on the latest scoops, and by subscribing, you'll always be in the loop. First up, the returning stars of the show, Jasmine and Gino. These two have been through the ringer on 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 Days, and now they're back for round three. Jasmine has finally made her way to Michigan from Panama, but it seems like the drama is following her. Ooh, a drama alert! What's that lipstick doing there, Gino? Jasmine isn't holding back, and this season, it's all about trust issues. Can they overcome this hurdle and make it down the aisle within their 90-day time frame? We'll be watching closely. Jasmine and Gino's journey has been nothing short of tumultuous. We've seen them battle intimacy issues, family conflicts, and financial struggles on previous seasons of Before the 90 Days. And just when we thought they were on the path to happiness, this lipstick discovery throws them for a loop. Is Gino really cheating on Jasmine? Or is there a reasonable explanation? Will their love conquer all? or will it crumble under the weight of suspicion? Now let's shift our attention to the newbies joining the 90 Day Fiancé Season 10 lineup. Brace yourselves, folks, because these couples are bringing their own unique flavors of drama. Meet Sophie and Rob, where Hollywood dreams meet a dose of reality. Will their love survive the stark contrast between Sophie's dreams and Rob's humble background in California? Sophie's vision of a glamorous life in the United States clashes with Rob's down-to-earth approach. Can they find a middle ground, or will their differences tear them apart? Then we have Manuel and Ashley, a love story that spans a decade. But will the years of distance and life changes tear them apart, or is this their happily ever after? Their history is marked by ups and downs, but can they make their long-awaited reunion work, or will they discover that time and separation have created unanticipated rifts? Citra and Sam, another international duo with a ticking clock. Can they win the blessing of Citra's father in just two weeks, especially after some sordid secrets come to light? The pressure is on for this couple as they navigate cultural differences and family expectations. Will love conquer all obstacles, or will it crumble under the weight of tradition and past mistakes? Moving forward, we have Justin and Nikki, a couple with a history that spans nearly two decades. Can they truly start fresh and leave the past behind even with a major revelation? We'll find out. Justin and Nikki's journey is one of second chances and acceptance. Can they build a future together despite the challenges of their shared history and a newfound understanding of each other? Next up is Devin and Nick, whose cultural differences and opinionated family could make or break their relationship. Will love conquer all, or will they be torn apart by external forces? As they bridge the gap between their backgrounds, they must also navigate the waters of family expectations. Will their love story have a happy ending, or will they succumb to the pressures of their respective worlds colliding? And now let's talk about Clayton and Annalai. Language barriers, fiery tempers, and living with Clayton's mother. This couple has some serious hurdles to jump over. Will they make it? Clayton and Anali's unique situation presents its own set of challenges. Anali's journey to learn English and adapt to life in Kentucky is complicated further by the revelation that Clayton has no plans to move out of his mother's house after marriage. How will they navigate this unexpected twist in their love story? So there you have it, folks. The upcoming season of 90 Day Fiancé Season 10 is packed with drama, love, and unexpected twists. You won't want to miss it, so mark your calendars for October 8th at 8 p.m. on TLC. And remember, hit that subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, and share this video twice for more reality TV gossip. 